Hi folks, welcome back to another vlog. Welcome back to another <laughs> layover vlog. Today's pairing is kind of impromptu because this pairing is a two-day pairing that I picked up from an FA because only because I forgot something here in Edmonton. I'm currently here in Edmonton. I purposely picked this one up because I had forgotten my apron, my trusty apron, about last week. And I couldn't just brush it away because not so much about the apron, but I have my can opener and also my old um, name tag attached to the apron, especially now that we have a different set of uniform look. I did not want to just, you know, have that old name tag be taken away or be forgotten. And so I had to make sure that I am reunited with my apron, which I did. I have it here. That's all that matters. But I want to quickly talk about what exactly happened, why I had lost that apron. So. I'm just gonna quickly sit here. What ended up happening was I worked a pairing probably a week ago, a week and a half ago. Anyway, I was lead on this particular flight and another crew from probably the previous flight or whatever forgot her bla Lakes blazer. So I was being lead, I was proactive about packing it nicely, putting a name tag, the tail number, and we'll have that blazer taken care of by the agent in Edmonton. And as I was doing it, I kind of got out of my routine and it threw me off pretty much. And so I had forgotten that I did not pack my apron. And true enough, I also left my apron on the exact same tail that I had found the blazer. And it was too late by the time I realized because we had to switch tails on that last leg going back to Vancouver from Edmonton. And they were towing the other aircraft that my apron was on. And so there was no chance that I was going to get it on the exact same night. Anyway, I had it tracked down. Thank God that I was able to track down the crew that was operating, operating on the exact same tail the next day and they found the apron, they got it sent to baggage services and I had called baggage services to make sure that they've received my apron and that I'm gonna be picking it up sooner or later. And then I found this pairing, somebody was dropping it and then I'm like, great, perfect two days, I'm actually working, I'm making money, but I'm also here to pick up that very reason I picked this pairing up for. That's the story in a nutshell. We did three legs today, so we started in Vancouver. We did Vancouver, Saskatoon, Saskatoon back to Vancouver, and then Vancouver to Edmonton. Tomorrow I'll be doing two legs. That'll be Edmonton to Calgary, and then Calgary back to my base in Vancouver, and I'm done for this pairing. This is a partial drop, which means the FA who dropped this particular partial pairing will be working the second half of the pairing, if that makes any sense. Anyway, that's all that matters. I'm happy that I'm reunited with my apron. So it's currently 1 o'clock in the morning, 1.30 in the morning almost. I'm tired, but I'm also not that sleepy yet. So we'll see how this goes. I'm gonna freshen up, probably do some reading, and then call it a day. I'm not sure if you, you guys notice it, by this look but I totally forgot to put mascara on like like what is going on <laughs> anyway I hope I still look okay even though something's missing before I freshen up I just want to make sure that I actually got the right apron I know I saw my name on it but just to make sure you know like this to me is kind of important, my can opener, but also this, this old name plate, name tag that I have that it's attached to this apron is the, probably one of the only reasons why I'm still going after this apron. Otherwise, I could have just, you know, bought a new one.
purpose of this trip is finished. I'm now heading back to Vancouver. I've got my apron situation all fixed, so I'm happy about that. Let's just get home to Vancouver, shall we? Folks, I'm back here in Vancouver and I'm just, I just want to quickly do an outro here because I'm dying to go home. Um, long story short, I got my apron back. <laughs> I know some people think it's silly, but to me it isn't because I have some stuff that's attached to that apron that I need and I value, aka my my older name plate and my can opener. Otherwise, I would have not gone for the apron anymore. But anyway, um, the good thing is I am able to retrieve it and it's in my possession again i'm happy about that plus i got to actually earn because i picked up a parent so i made money so win-win for me anyway thank you so much for watching this vlog again if you did like it please give it a thumbs up you know the drill you know subscribe turn on the notification bell so you'll get an update as soon as i've uploaded a video i will see you guys next time on